All right, my friends, how are you all doing? Welcome back to the channel and welcome to a fresh episode of FM20 and the Palermo Problem. My friends, last episode is above right now. That was the cup final against Catania. Uh, feel free to go and check that out and go get caught up. Today, it is title decider day. We've got two games to play. And we are in with a chance of winning Sierra C the first time of asking. Sierra B next season, should we manage it? But with the chasing pack are still there. Let's take a look and then try to get promoted. So, ladies and gents, in last episode, I ran you through all of the games that were played between last episode and the final, and it's kind of what's put us in this position now. You're going to see a five-point gap at the top. Um, it's basically in our hands. It's, it's basically there for us to throw away, should we wish. It's also there for us to win and get promoted if we want to. Now, we've got a few injury problems, a few first-team players out. Um, we need to be at our best and that's exactly what we're going to try and do in today's episode. Um, we need one win. That's all we need. One win. If we can't manage that, we at least need a draw. Because then it comes down to goal difference at the end of the season. But surely, surely, we can't throw it away from here. Let me show you the games that we're going to play today. The two teams we're going to take on. Uh, Albi Albino Leffi, we played them in the Cup. They were a very difficult opposition. They're 12th in the table. And then in the last game of the season, we take on 17th, uh, Pontadera. So, not the hardest games, but we all know how football is. Not the easiest either. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's crack on with the first game. Uh, in this one, towards potential title winning feelings again. I'd really just got lost of what to say there. I've been immense with my words. I've felt like Shakespeare recently, but not with that one. Um, it is a rotated team for many reasons. First off, injuries. Second, international duty. It's come at the worst bloody time, uh, but we have lost a key player to international duty. But we're going to go with Aragadri in goal, Akadi at right back, Ranieri at left back. They have been a staple all season long. Garcia is going to partner Jorge Silva in this game. Silva comes in for Harwood Bellis, who is on international duty. Uh, Palazzi is going to play next to Scandrini. Droglio in the midfield. I feel like Palazzi getting forward. Uh, just slightly better than Pabega at the moment. So we need that. Diamico is going to play down the right. We've got Bari. He is actually another player who's come through the academy. He's going to play on the left. He's actually not half bad. And has been putting in better performances than Andia recently. So that's why I'm going to give him a go. Rafia is going to play Cam. And we're going to stick with Skamaka. Didn't have the best of cup finals. But has been playing very well recently. Uh, so let's hope he can get the goals in this game. So here we go, ladies and gentlemen. This is a big one. Uh, win this, and then the last game of the season uh, just becomes basically none and void. It really doesn't matter. This is the game I would love to win. And early doors, Candroglio puts in a free kick. It's cleared out, though. Um, Palazzi is going to get there. He's going to come back to Garcia, who just finds someone. He's going to come all the way back to the goalkeeper. I'm quite surprised at that. He had a man next to him, but... Avogadri finds Jorge Silva, who's actually done very well when he's been asked to come in in place of Harwood Bellis. Palazzi comes back to Akadi. He's going to come side into Scandroglio. A little one-two there with Jorge Silva, who gives the ball away. That's sloppy. It really is sloppy. Uh, there was no need for that. Bari closes the man down, misses the challenge, though. I fear they are going to go and score here. Ball through the middle. Look how easy. Look how easy that was. All from a sloppy pass out from defence. Right. Silva has picked that up. That was quite a good play from him. That's all right. That ball's a lot better than the one he played last time. Diamico. Oh, why does he always shoot? He's so shit in those situations. Right, throw in to the opposition. Uh, just Diamico winds me up there. Always shoots. That's a brilliant challenge. That's going to go out. Monza are 1-0 up. So uh, the gap is within two points now because we're losing. Um, really need to get back in this one. Corner comes in. Come on, tackle him. Just press, press, press and get him out. Right, half time, we're still 1-0 down and uh, we have been fucking awful in that game. Literally no chances created. Everyone is all at sea. Right, throw in to the opposition. I've actually gone very attacking to start this second half. I don't know if that's going to hurt us and shoot us in the foot. I hope it isn't. A missed header though there from Akadi. That's not great. He dives in. He's saved from Avogadri. We are all over the place at the back. We're usually so solid. Right, throw in at... Uh 
the opposition again, and it's all them. All the all the, the proper chances are coming their way. We have done absolutely nothing in this game. Good pass there. Any chance of anyone just deciding to put a tackle in? Where on earth is the fullback? Why is he tucked in so much? Oh, it's a ball in. It's awful. It is awful. We have been shocking. Throw in to them again. I feel like we're going to be on the end of a spanking here because we just are doing nothing and we can't get back in the game. Bari out to Ranieri. It's a beautiful effort, but it is the post and that is just our luck in this game. Right, I've got to make some changes. Um... I really don't know what to do though. I don't know how to affect the game because we've just been terrible. Um, 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 um. I think Scandroglio is going to make way and we're going to bring Bobby Duncan on in his place and we're going to go two up top. Um, and yeah, we're really going for it basically because we have to. We've been nowhere in the game. Um, we're going to go wing back this side as well. Um, and I think Bari, I think he can make way. He really just hasn't got into this game. So yeah, that's two substitutions made. Change of tactic. We're going for it. Okay, free kick to the opposition. We are going to leave ourselves wide open in the midfield uh, playing like this. But we have no choice, ladies and gents. As they come forward again, they score now and it is all over. He shanked the shot. but And just to add insult to injury, Ranieri's got injured. So he's going to have to come off. Cravello's coming on for him. This game is done. It's over. We're not creating chances. We're not doing anything. We look awful. Right, throw in. Crivello with it into Endia. They've somehow managed to keep that. Endia loses the ball, though. We're all up the other end of the pitch. This is why I don't play Endia. Oh, my God. It just is just so bad. And how on earth has he not finished that off? I think he was offside anyway. This is the worst I've seen us play in weeks. Right, corner. Rafia with it. Can we get a goal? Can someone do something? Rafia again. Into Endia. Endiamico. Finally, finally, finally. We do something in the game. Right, there's a throw in deep in their half. Can we win the ball back? Oh. God, I can't believe it's taken us this long to decide to get going in the game. But there's one ball over the top. Oh, my days. Oh, my days. Five minutes added on. There's a highlight to the opposition. This is what we've seen all game long. It's just been all them. They've been more clinical than us. We have just wasted and wasted so many opportunities. That's it, the woodwork. And that's come back in. Avogadri saves. We, de we deserve to lose. We really do deserve to lose this. And if we lose the league, if we lose the league title in the, if, by losing the next game, I don't know what I'll do. I'll, I'll, that was awful. And well, unbelievably, ladies and gents, it comes down to this. Lose this. Monza win. We're in this division again next season. And I can't quite believe I'm saying that. Cruelly, we're still without Harwood Bellis because he's on international duty. I can't believe that one of our best players all season can't be involved at this crucial time of the season. It's ridiculous. But anyway, Avogadri is going to play in goal. Acardi Cravello fullback. Jorgis Silva and Garcia at centre-back. Pabega and Palazzi midfield. Diamico and Dia wings. Rafia through the middle. Bobby Duncan is getting one last bite of the cherry because Skamaka just hasn't been at it. Let's hope we win this game and we go up. Because if I throw it away now, this will be the biggest bottle job Ever. So here we go. They walk out onto the pitch for the biggest game of their careers so far. It's as simple as that. We have to win. Okay, we've got a throw in very early in the game. Cravello with it. And he finds Bobby Duncan with that throw in. Bobby Duncan, nice touch there to go forward. Now Pabega drives into the box. That shot, though, is bloody awful. Unbelievably, Monza are getting beat 2-0 by Renato. It's unbelievable. Renate were the team that beat us recently, and they're now doing us a favour against Monza. Uh, we've got a throw in again. It's into Palazzi. He's going to come all the way right. That's a very strange thing to do. Into Jorge Silva now. He's going to find Akadi. Into Pabega. Akadi's on the overlap. Lovely stuff from him. Back to Pabega. Into Rafia, who's shot. It gets blocked, but we've still got this. Pabega and uh, Akadi were a bit too uh, close together there for me. Akadi into Palazzi. Come on now. Come on. 
Back to Icardi. Lovely run from Diemico. Where's he going to go with this? Back to Pabega! Hits it from the edge of the area. It's 1-0 Palermo. And surely, 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 one foot in Serie B. Right, goal kick to the opposition. Um, come on, Icardi. Oh, Icardi should have really got there. And that's a lovely ball over the top. We keep getting done by them. That's a brilliant challenge by Silva, though. Ball coming in. Well headed out. Lovely defensive work from the boys. Right, free kick. Rafia over here. Oh, so close. Half time. It's still only 1-0. And this is now biting stuff. Um, Benevento winning. Monza losing. We only need a draw with it being like that. But we're in the box seat. 1-0 up. Just need to see this out. Right, I'm going to make a change just because I want to stay on the safe side. Uh, Leon, Lionel Miguel is going to come on uh, for Silva. Silva was having a good game, but he picked up a knock, and I I don't want to risk it. Uh, that's all I'm going to do for now. It's still 1-0. Not much has happened in this second half. Um, but yeah, we've got half hour to go. All right, throw in. Cravello into Rafia. Back to Cravello. Come on, come on. Rafia again. Back to Cravello. Lovely stuff. India. Rafia. Oh, wow. I don't know. I think that was a Rabona pass for Rafia. Good effort. Save from the keeper. It goes on, though. And uh, that's a good pass. Oh, my God. Please don't say they're going to score. Please don't say they're going to score. That was too close for comfort. Throw in Cravello into Rafia, And that is going to be a second yellow card by the looks of things. Then down to 10 men. And surely advantage to us. Um, we're into the last five minutes of the game. We're going to scrape it by the looks of things by one goal to nil. But it doesn't matter because that is enough to win us. The league, ladies and gents. Six minutes added on. Oh, my God. Renate get a third against Monza. They've done us a favour. They were the ones that could have caught us. Um, second half has been boring in this game. But we are going to go up to Serie B as champions. Ladies and gents, that is, we've done the unthinkable. I thought we were going to get stuck in this division for a couple of years. But we have put together a beautiful young team and they have managed to bring the league home. I couldn't be happier. I know full well from next season that's when this series is going to get very difficult. Our finances are non-existent. You're going to see all that in the roundup episode that will come next. But... We're champions! So we lift it, ladies and gents, on the last day. Um, unbelievable effort from the lads. Uh, Benevento won 3-0. Monza lost 3-0. Um, so nothing would have mattered. A draw would have been enough, but we got the 1-0 victory. Uh, Palermo also obviously do the double this season. Uh, beautiful stuff. Jorge Silva just out for uh, a, a week. Uh, Miguel, he made his debut. Um... Board set initial budgets uh, for the upcoming season. A wage uh, of 69000 a transfer budget of 52k. Yeah, that's what we're playing with in Syrup B, ladies and gents. Oh, it's going to be fun. Um, but yes, Colin Briggs glory to Palermo. Feel free to pause any of this, ladies and gents, and take a look. We were 5-1 to one pre preseason uh, odds before the season kicked off. Remember, we were uh, media prediction was fourth, but we've managed to outdo that, finish first, and we go up as champions, ladies and gents. And so this is how the league table finished, ladies and gents. Uh, you'll see 38 games played, 26 wins, 8 draws, 4 defeats, 86 points on the board. Our closest compare was Benevento in the end with 82 points Monza finished third on 81 points we're very very close going into those last two games and Juventus were left way way behind on 63 points uh, unfortunately Bobby Duncan didn't finish top goal scorer his form really tailed off but I think the star of the show this season has to have been Rafia. 
So there you have it, my friends. We've done and dusted for another episode of The Palermo Problem. And next season, we will be in Serie B. It's going to be unbelievable. We were just one step away then from Serie A and achieving the first goal of the series. Back-to-back -back promotions was never going to be easy, but somehow we managed to achieve it. Next episode will be a roundup of this season. Do make sure you tune in for that. But my friends, until next time, if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. It's the best way to support the channel. Drop a like on the video if you've enjoyed it and hit that bell notification button to never miss an upload. My friends, we go up as champions of Serious C. You've all been legends. I'll see you next time.